under the topic linear equations with variable coefficients here we have the second problem one solution of l of y equal to y double dash plus 1 by 4 x squared y equal to 0 for x greater than 0 is phi of x equal to x to the power 1 by 2 show that there is another solution xi of the form xi equal to u phi where u is some function now here this is a second order e linear equation with variable coefficient and it is a non-homogeneous equation and they have said that uh, actually this uh, equation will have two solutions and they have given one of the solution here phi of x is equal to x bar 1 by 2 and they are asking us to evaluate the next solution that is the second solution and the second solution is of the form xi equal to u phi. So let us see how to solve this problem. So first let us take and write the given um, equation L of y. So L of y is given to be equal to y double dash plus 1 by 4x squared y equal to 0. And they are saying that xi is a solution of this equation which means xi will satisfy this equation. So from this we can uh, substitute xi instead of y and so we get xi double dash plus 1 by 4 x squared xi is equal to 0. Now what is xi is given to be? xi is equal to u phi. So it is in this form where phi is given as x to the power 1 by 2. So xi will be equal to u multiplied with phi which is x to the power 1 by 2. Now we have to find xi double dash and we have to substitute xi double dash and xi in this equation in order to solve for xi. So first let us find xi dash for this. So if xi is equal to this, so from this we obtain xi dash to be equal to. Now we have to use uv method and solve this. So first let us have u as it is and let us differentiate x power 1 by 2. And so the differentiation of x power 1 by 2 is 1 by 2 x to the power 1 by 2 minus 1 so it will be negative 1 by 2 okay so this is done and then now after that we should have this as it is so x to the power 1 by 2 multiplied with differentiation of u which we can write it as u dash and so xi we have up i mean xi dash we have obtained to be this on uh, simplifying and rewriting this we can write this as 1 by 2 u to the power u x to the power negative 1 by 2 plus u dash x to the power 1 by 2. Now we have to find xi double dash from this. So xi double dash will be equal to now first we shall uh, have this 1 by 2 common out and u when we have as it is and when we differentiate x to the power negative 1 by 2 we get minus 1 by 2 x to the power minus 1 by 2 minus 1 which will be minus 3 by 2 okay plus now x to the power negative 1 by 2 we should have it as it is and differentiate u which will be u dash so this is for the first term now we will take the second one so plus in a similar way u dash first let us have it as it is and differentiate x bar 1 by 2 which is 1 by 2 x to the power 1 by 2 minus 1 which is minus 1 by 2 plus x to the power 1 by 2 which let's have it as it is and differentiate u dash which is u double dash. So now we have to further simplify this. So that will be equal to so multiplying this 1 by 2 within the I um, mean this first term what do we get we get it as negative 1 by 4 so negative 1 by 4 and then u and then x to the power negative 3 by 2 and then this 1 by 2 has to be multiplied with this term and we get uh, 1 by 2 u dash x to the power negative 1 by 2 and then the third term that is this term we have to write so that will be plus 1 by 2 u dash x to the power negative 1 by 2 plus this last term which is u double dash x to the power 1 by 2 and on further simplification xi double dash will be equal to so this term let us write it as it is negative 1 by 4 u x to the power negative 3 by 2 and this term and this term adds up to 1 because here we have 1 by 2 here we have 1 by 2 which is which becomes 
and these two terms are same so we can add these two and it becomes u dash x to the power negative 1 by 2 plus u double dash x bar 1 by 2 so this is our uh, xi double dash so let us substitute xi double dash and xi in this equation and let us see what we obtain so now in this equation i have taken and substituted this is xi double dash and this one is xi and 1 by 4 x squared we have here so xi equal to 0 so now this term can be further simplified and this will become plus uh, 1 by 4 u this uh, 2 when taken above it will become uh, x to the power 1 by 2 minus 2 so what will be 1 by 2 minus 2 it will be minus 3 by 2 so this these terms will remain the same so u x to the power negative 3 by 2 plus u dash x to the power negative 1 by 2 plus u double dash x to the power 1 by 2 and this term on simplification becomes like this so is equal to 0 and we see that this term and this term are same this with a positive sign and this with a negative sign and so we can cancel these two terms so after cancelling these two terms this will be the remaining term so let us take and write that so we obtain this to be u dash and this x power 1 by 2 we will write take it to the denominator and let us write it as x power 1 by 2 okay with this negative sign when it goes to the denominator it becomes positive plus u double dash x power 1 by 2 is equal to 0 so this is what we get now what we shall do we shall uh, divide this full equation throughout by so let us divide by x to the power 1 by 2 so what will happen here u dash divided by already we have x power 1 by 2 here and when it is uh, multiplied with x power 1 by 2 that is the denominator it becomes x power 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 which is x plus u double dash or uh, we have x power 1 by 2 here and when this is divided by x power 1 by 2 both gets cancelled and so this will be equal to 0 and from this we get u double dash to be equal to taking this term to the other side negative u dash divided by x so now what we shall do from this you can bring this u dash here so it will become u double dash divided by u dash is equal to negative 1 by x now we shall integrate on both the sides so when we integrate on both the sides with respect to x we get integral u double dash by u dash dx is equal to negative integral 1 by x dx so while integrating we know that if the numerator is the uh, differentiation of the denominator then that will be uh, equal to log of the denominator the integral of that is equal to the log of the denominator so this turns out to be log of the denominator is log of u dash is equal to minus integral of n by x is log x so this is what we have so further this can be written as log u dash is equal to log x to the power negative 1 taking this minus 1 here because by using the logarithmic rule okay so by using the logarithmic rule this one can be taken here and it can be written like this while comparing on both the sides we can see that u dash is equals to x to the power negative 1 so u dash is equal to x power minus 1 now from that we can get u dash to be equal to 1 by x now after this we shall integrate again on both the sides that is integral u dash dx is equal to integral 1 by x dx now uh, the integral on the left hand side will be integral of u dash is u which is equal to integral of 1 by x is log x so we can write log x here so uh, now we have obtained u to be equal to log x so now our solution xi is equal to what we know that it is equal to u phi which is equal to u is log x and phi is x to the power 1 by 2 so multiplied with x power 1 by 2 so therefore our final solution xi will be equal to x power 1 by 2 multiplied with log x 
So this is how we solve the problems when one solution is given and another solution is asked to find. So we are given the solution phi of x and we have been asked to find the solution xi which is of the form u phi and we have got the solution to be x power 1 by 2 log x. Hope you have understood this problem. Thank you.